welcome to 2K Sports and another exciting edition of NBA Basketball. I'm Kevin Harlan alongside Richard Jefferson and Greg Anthony. And with us from the sidelines tonight, David Aldridge. We'll see the Houston Rockets facing the New York Knicks and the Houston Rockets starting five. we got Harden. Moses Malone out there with Drexel. Then it's Elijah Wan and it's McGrady in at the two guard. Harden against Frazier. Harden dishes to Drexler. Now here's Elijah Wan. Pass to Harden. Shoots the three. That's good. And it's Elijah Wan with the assist. A staple of Harden's attack. His three-point shot is about as lethal as it gets. Anthony against Drexler. And that one's good, Anthony. I know what they say, defense wins championships, but you need some bucket getters too now. Up top, Elijah Wan. We play just over a minute here in the first. Puts it up from 12, and the basket by Harden. Harden's got five. Just an absolute master at creating separation. That is a nice move by Harden to free himself up. Now Reed, and the pass to Garen. Cracks in the tray. And he's not going to miss that sort of an opportunity from deep. Here's McGrady. Elijah on outside. Pass to Harden. Six to shoot. Outside, Malone. Passes to McGrady. Count the bucket, and he's got a free That's throw good. coming up as well. First and you can One see shot. that backcourt just setting the tone for the entire team. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the game here. One of the most ferocious scorers in the game. McGrady's length and athleticism is so difficult to contain. It's blocked. Drexler with the ball. The deep three from Harden. It's hauled in by Ewing. And just under two and a half minutes elapsed here in the first. Frazier the pass to Anthony. Jawan with the block. Without a doubt, one of the most versatile shot blockers in the game. Elijah Wan does it in the painted area as well as along the perimeter. Frazier, Frazier, Frazier. And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. If he gets that look again, he should take it. You can't let one miss scare you off of a very good shot. Here's Harden. It's rebounded by New York. That was a good look for him from mid-range, but just couldn't make the defense pay. Anthony against Drexler. Pulls up on the wing. Shot's good by Anthony. Anthony's got his second basket of the night. With a forward who can handle the ball like Anthony, it opens up so many options for your offense. Here's Harden. Ewing gets the rebound. The Knicks with the lead. Drexler with the steal. McGrady outside. Ewing gets the rebound. Ewing's got four rebounds now tonight. Pass to Anthony. Knocks it loose. Just four to shoot. 
Here's Harden. The 18-footer is right on the mark. Harden's got his third bucket of the night. Come on, that lefty stroke of James Harden. Just so pretty. Garen passes to Reed. Harden against Frazier. Back to Reed. Frazier outside. Reed against Malone. Reed misses. And it's Houston's ball. McGrady kicks to Harden. Always going up for the alley-oop here. And it's Elijah Wan with the jam. Capable of playing either guard position. Harden's sense for when his teammates are open is ridiculous. Drexler against Anthony. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. Oh, the officials are all over that. The Knicks shooting their first free throws of the game. For New York, Carmelo Anthony. At the line, two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That's good from Anthony. A lights-out scorer who possesses incredible confidence. Anthony is such a skilled and explosive player. So he hits one of two from the strike. Houston in the lead. Drexler finds Harden over Frazier. And Harden gets it to go in on the assist by Drexler. Harden's got nine points. No problem for Harden scoring under pressure. On the wing, Ewing. Good D by Elijah Wan. Houston leading by three. McGrady passes to Elijah Wan. There's the dish to Harden. Malone outside. With his first shot attempt. And the rebound goes to the Knicks. Garen passes to Frazier. Kicks to Reed. And there's the pass to Ewing. That shot off the mark. Nice defense from Malone. Harden surveying the D. Malone outside. They get a hand on it. Reed with the steal. From 13, the shot's good by Anthony. Seven points in the game. Good thinking from Anthony. He's so good at going right up with that shot. McGrady passes to Elijah Wan. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. It's on Patrick Ewing. Rockets have started out 0 of 1 from the line, missing their only other attempt early. Hakeem Elijah Wan at the line. Two shots. And he makes the first. And New York making a change here. DeBusher is checked in. And a switch here also for Houston. Murphy's checked in. So he gets them both. And so New York calls timeout. They're first. Ewing. Ewing's got his second bucket. 
How about the muscle inside from Ewing? Easily getting to wherever he wants to on that low block. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. It's on Patrick Ewing. Way to attack there and then create the contact. For Houston, they have gone two for three at the foul line in this one. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. And very few players have ever been as good from the line as Murphy. This is his zone, and he's been known to go weeks without missing a free throw. Kings checked in for Ewing. And so Murphy hits them both. Now he's perfectly comfortable doing work at the line. Knicks trail by three. Oh, and there's the alley-oop. And stolen by Malone. Drexler against Anthony. Drexler dishes to Hart. Another miss by Houston. And so here is New York. Frazier with it. Picked up by Malone. I both shot. And again, it's New York. Found some space to get off the mid-range. And he'll do damage from there if you let him. So it's the Rockets now. And here's Murphy. Outside, Malone. Pass to Harden. Five to shoot. It's rebounded by New York. Frazier outside. Passes it to Carmelo. Stolen by Elijah Wong. Harden against Anthony. Harden kicks to Murphy. Pass to Drexler. Back to Murphy. Here is Harden. The tray. Again, the miss by Harden. And he might have thrown himself off when he saw how much space he had from three. Over to the wing. Frazier the pass to Reed. King outside. Shot clock at six. Pope loose. Malone with the steal. Drexler against King. Drexler kicks to Murphy. At the top of the key, Malone. Dishes it to Harden. Six on the shot clock. Back to Malone. Good. It's Harden with the assist that time. And Malone, a high percentage score when he gets it in deep. Well, once he's got the defense on his back, the game becomes easy with his ability to score. Time call here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. Richardson, he's checked in for Frazier. And the Rockets making a change here as well. Chris Paul's checked in for James Harden. Knicks trail by three. Reed a screen on Paul. Here's Richardson, and the layup's good off the glass. I'm not sure who was supposed to be on him that possession. I mean, apparently, not the, the defenders. Now the pass to Malone. Elijah Wan inside. The Bush on him. And then Elijah Wan with the dunk. I mean, I hope you can appreciate the torque that that kind of move generates. He just has that natural explosiveness. The dream is something to behold. Anthony can't hit. Look, the defense was locked in on him there. They know how dangerous he can be, and they guarded him perfectly. Wasted no time on that one. And now a five-point rocket lead. 
the ageless wonder. Paul's jump shot has only gotten better over time. Richard to the tape. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. And look at how the hustle game has been going for Houston. From the very start of this game, they have been giving the ball handlers trouble, using good pressure to force turnovers and get steals. And you're also seeing that high motor in terms of their ability to block shots or alter them, bringing that presence defensively. First free throw is good. Say this about Richardson. He is a fearless player. There isn't an opponent who doesn't think he can dominate or, or situation he can't take charge of. There is no back down in Michael Ray. Catching up on the changes for New York. Stoudemire's checked in for Reed, and it's Frazier in for Anthony. And Richardson drops them both. And it's Harden with the ball for Houston. Three-point lead. Pass to Tom Janovich. He kicks to Murphy. Next so it's both teams making substitutions here. Team foul. Substitution on the court. One forty four and left to play in the first. Four on the shot clock. And here's Harden for three. Here's Yao. And finished off by Yao. And Ming is, is mammoth in terms of his size. Exceptional at using it to snare those offensive rebounds. One twenty-four left in the first quarter. Murphy against Frazier. Stoudemire with a screen on Hart. Houston, the pass to Stoudemire. Over Yao. Yao with the block. And you have to appreciate the reach of me. Superb at putting himself in a good position there to block the shot. The now, here is Murphy. Tries the spin move. It's hauled in by Frazier. Next trail by five. Down low. And the jam by Stoudemire. And Stoudemire, a dunking machine out there. Remarkable at getting the position he needs to bring that one home. And here's Harden for three. Basket number five goes in. He's now 5 of 12 from the floor. You can't lose a shooter like him on the court. The ball will find its way to him, and he will drill a three each time. Fires from 18. And Walt Frazier, the basket on the assist by DeBusher. Frazier's got his second bucket of the game to go. The shot and game clock separated by four. Now, here is Murphy. Yao, the pass to Harden. Five on the clock. Houston needs to get a shot off. Hayes finds Murphy. Another shot, and the layup good by Yao. And this is where you feed Yao because almost no one is going to be able to block it. James Harden getting it done for the Houston Rockets. That quarter had to take a lot out of him. He racked up 12 points. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. And hope you've enjoyed the broadcast so far. Halfway through the first half in this one. And when you consider how the Rockets are doing, guys, what do you think? I mean, offensively, I thought they did a good job of protecting the ball. And defensively, boy, were they disrupted. Winning the turnover battle is so important. They've been sharp so far, and it's showing up on the scoreboard. 
Rockets leading by six. King is out there with DeBusher. And it's Stoudemire. Then there's Frazier. And it's Houston at the shooting guard. They're the group New York will start the second. Round. Now, here's Yao. They lead by six, their biggest margin. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. And Yao just so big, he's able to see over the top of the defense. And that allows him to find an open team. Pass to Houston. Let's the free fly. Buries it from three-point range. Well, we come at us, and we're coming right back at you. Yeah, I love the competitive fire right there. You train a triple on us, and I'm coming for my revenge. Now, here is Harden over Houston. And Houston again with the bucket. The D has to know Harden is looking to shoot because that's what he does whenever he gets a chance, especially from the mid-range. Murphy against Frazier. Out to the wing. Here in the second quarter with a little over a minute gone. Nine feet out. DeBusher can't get the basket. Rockets leading by eight. Now Murphy. He's looking for Hayes and finds him. Up high to stuff the alley-oop. There's just so much Murphy can do with the ball in his hands. He can score himself when he has to, but finding an open teammate like that is always his first priority. Now here's Stoudemire. Six to shoot. Pass to Houston. No good with the wing jumper. Murphy against DeBusher. Now here is Murphy. Defense is right there. Puts it up from 17. Here's Hayes. His shot is good, making him a perfect two for two from the floor. Hard work on the offensive glass, paying off with the second chance points there for Hayes. If he's got a shot at the rebound, he's not going to let anybody else take it away. Now here's Frazier. Stoudemire with a screen on Murphy. Here's Frazier. Here's Stoudemire. Good, and it's Frazier who picks up the assist. Frazier's got three assists now in this one. Harden outside. With the teardrop, and the layup is good. Harden's got the lead up to 12 now for the Rockets. Fooled the D that time. Harden with the soft touch, okay. Frazier the pass to King. Back to Frazier. Got it. Good job in the low post. Frazier's got six. Wow, what a pass there. He made that a very easy basket with that setup. Right wing. There's the three. And again, it's the Rockets from deep. Uh, unwilling to let up, even for a moment. That's his killer instinct, just fanning the flame. Always plays hard until the final whistle, no matter what the situation is. Here is Frazier after the Rockets pick up three. There's the pass to Houston. And it's blocked. You know, some might say Hayes plays the game angry. And there's there was definitely something angry about his defense there. What an emphatic rejection. Now here's Frazier. He's got six. Here's Houston. To the inside. Stoudemire. Beautiful dish. And the layup goes down. Stoudemire's got four points now in the quarter. And Stoudemire just moves so well in that pick and roll. Just cuts the D to shreds with that set. Yao dishes to Hart. Feeds to Hayes. Pass to Harden over Houston. Harden, no good. Credit the defensive effort there, not giving him room to operate. King against Murphy. Frazier with it. Inside, here's Stoudemire, and it's Stoudemire with the jam. The peripheral vision, the decisive delivery, those are things you love about Frazier's artistry as a playmaker. Here's Murphy, plays it up and banks it in. Murphy. And the Rockets lead by 11. When you allow good scores to get uncontested shots at the rim, no wonder you're losing. 
That's a great possession. Put your best players in a position to succeed. And let's head over to the sideline and catch up with David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. Now, load management is among the new buzzwords around the league. Now, Adam Silver says maybe on top of your typical guaranteed contracts, some incremental money should be based on number of games played and results of those games. That's how most industries work. Kevin, we've seen changes with that. The league now mandates 65 games played during a season to qualify for most individual awards. David, I'm a fan of it. It's a step-by-step -step process, but they've got to do something it looks like they are. Thanks so much for the report. And so it's Paul with it, bringing it up for the Houston Rockets. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. Here's Elijah Wan. And the rebound goes to the Knicks. Frazier outside. Passes it to Garen. New York moving the ball around. Barnett against McGrady. Just five on the clock. Malone with the block. I mean, how about the quicks there by Malone to get up and deter that shot, utilizing that size and reach for the rejection. Now, here is Harden. He's got 19. McGrady outside. To the middle. You have to play hard and tightly. That thing gets more defenders than you think. The Rockets have only one missed free throw. They've had five attempts and made four of them. James Harden at the line. Two shots. That free throw good from Harden. And Harden is capable of getting you a triple-double every game. His versatility is incredible. The Knicks making a switch here. Richardson's checked in. And both free throws good for James Harden. Knicks trail by nine. Richardson outside. McGrady against Barnett. Richardson outside. Just five to shoot. Here's Garrett. Shakes off the strong D and gets the bucket for two. Garrett's got five. Pockets leading by seven. Passed him alone. He dishes it to Hart. Elbow shot is on the way. Good, and it's Malone picking up the assist. Harden's got 23. It's tough to defend that. The defense was there. Harden just makes a difficult, difficult shot. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. New York shooting their fifth and sixth free throws of the game. At the line for the Knicks, Michael Ray Richardson. At the line, two shots. Take a break, take a break. Two shots. That's good from Richardson. and drops them both. And here's Harden. 23 points in the game. And out of bounds as the Knicks gain possession. 
And we got to take a second look to admire that outstanding block. And boy, did he get up quick to reject that shot. That's as fundamental as defense gets. And so here is New York. Seven-point differential. On the wing, Ewing. Back to Richardson. The pass to Guerin. Five to shoot. New York needs to get off a shot. And there's Patrick Ewing on the assist from Reed. Ewing's got eight. Rockets leading by five. Ball looking over the floor. Malone wide open. And Houston again with the bucket. And this is what Paul is known for. He is a shrewd distributor with a pass-first mentality. New York calls timeout. Knicks trail by seven. Pass to Reed. Ewing against Malone. Fires from 18. Elijah Wan grabs the miss. And so it's Paul with it, bringing it up for the Houston Rockets. Malone in the corner. Paul outside. Houston moving the ball around. Elijah Wan the pass to Harden. That's good, and it's Elijah Wan with the assist. Elijah Wan's got three assists now in this one. Passes it to Reed. Richardson against Paul. Back to Reed. Over Elijah Wan. Elijah Wan with the block. And it's out of bounds to New York. They'll retain possession. Rocket six. Pass to Ewing. Nice defense from Malone. Houston leading by 10. Harden kicks to Paul. Harden the pass to Malone. Back to Harden. Shot from the wing. Patrick Ewing comes up with the rebound. Ewing's got six rebounds now in the game. the pass to Barnett. Ewing right side. Pass to Reed. Here's Gary. Guarded by Hart. And the shot clock expires. 24 second violation. Anthony's checked in for New York. Frazier comes in for Richardson. I Drexler's checked in for Houston. Now here's Harden. He's got 26. Kicks to McGrady. Back to Harden. Shot clock at five. Richardson, he's checked in for New York. Second team. Coming on to the floor for your New York Knicks. Number 20, Michael Ray Richardson. On the wing, Drexler, covered by Anthony. Drexler passes to McGrady. The basket good off the assist from Drexler. McGrady's got his second bucket of the night. And, and how about getting a hand up on McGrady, especially when he's looking to shoot first on the outside. Pass to Reed. 
The kick out to Frazier. Pass to Richardson. In the floater, Malone with the block. Drexler passes to McGrady. Al Harden at the elbow, Elijah Wong. Goes back up. Danny battles for the ball and gets the second chance bucket. Elijah Wong's got eight points. Such a graceful player. Uh, Hakeem is, is light off the ground there for that rebound. And then the skill to send that one home. To halt the run. Oh, he blocked it and deflects off the backboard. 11 left to play here in the second quarter. Knocked away. And the ball travels out of bounds. It was last touched by Harden. And New York making a change. Starks is checked in. Number three, John Starks. 104 left to play here in the half. Outside, Ewing. And the pass to Reed. Shoots over Malone. That's good. The Houston lead is cut to just 11 on the basket from Willis Reed. Well, the, the pick didn't exactly neutralize the defender, but, but good concentration on the finish to still get the basket. Now, here's Elijah Wan. Eight points for him. The dish to Hart. Back to Elijah Wan. It's good. The assist that time from Harden. Elijah Wan's got four points now in the quarter. And that's just too deep. Uh, Elijah Wan with way too many moves in there. Almost automatic. Here's Ewing. Elijah Wan with the block. McGrady passes to Harden. Three-pointer. And another three for Houston. Yet another three. Once we hit the second quarter, it just seems as if those threes just started to fall like raindrops. Outside Anthony. He kicks to Starks. Fires the three. No good that time. So as we conclude the first half, so far, fairly. Rockets lead by 16. And don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of the third quarter. As we dive into the second half, we'll find out if the next two quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it has been a runaway. An exceptional performance so far from James Harden. He's done a fantastic job of finding open space to operate with, within the first few quarters. I like how they came into this one with the game plan, and they're just going out and executing it. Terrific job. And with a big gap on the scoreboard, the second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to project their lead. So on the floor for Houston, we've got Drexler, Harden out there with Tracy McGrady, then there's Moses Malone. And it's Elijah Wan in at the five down low. Six on the shot clock. Harden kicks to McGrady. And it's off from three-point range. Next trail by 16. Pass to Reed. Anthony taking his time here. 
takes a shot at the elbow, and it's Drexler with the rebound. Drexler's got four rebounds now tonight. From deep Harden. It's rebounded by New York. About one minute played here in the second half. Drexler against Anthony. Passes to Guerin. Looking for Ewing. He gets it there. Yep, that one goes in there. Ewing's got the first points at the third quarter up on the board for New York. Houston leading by 14. Al Harden. He's got 29 points. Pass to Malone. Drexler with it. And some nice passing there by Houston. And here's Anthony for three. Drills it from outside. Anthony's got 10 points in the game. And Anthony is certainly capable of sinking the triple. But D has to respect that quick release and get out on it. Elijah on finds Harden. Outside, Drexler. Back to Harden. The pass to Elijah Wan. Count it. Good. And 12 points for Hakeem Elijah Wan. And that's right where they wanted to go with the ball in rhythm. Ewing, a screen on Drexler. And here's Anthony for three. And another three for New York. That's a nice play. Getting the separation he needs for a clean look. And you know it takes skill for you to get your shot up over a bigger guy. Little Johnny Killer. That's impressive stuff. Second half of play with just under two and a half minutes gone. Anthony against Drexler. Anthony dishes to Ewing. To the wing on the left. They get it back. And another shot. Malone with the block. And it's out of bounds to the Knicks as New York retains possession. And right now, let's watch that terrific swat. And a block like that sends a message. One that says we're not giving up this lead. New York calls timeout. One of the stories here, James Harden getting it done today. This timeout gives them a chance to strategize because whatever the game plan they have, it's not working. Clock keeps going. Three minutes into the second half now. Six to shoot. Reed a screen on Drexler. The three from Anthony. Rockets with the rebound. Elijah has got four rebounds now tonight. Drexler passes to Harden. Elijah Wan outside. Dishes it to McGrady. Harden against Frazier. And the basket by Harden. Harden's got 31. Having a bad possession? Look, just get it to James Harden. He'll make everything okay. Ewing a screen on Harden. And the officials will call the illegal screen right there. When a pick like that is questionable and creates that much of an advantage for the offense, you have to to blow the whistle. You gotta blow the whistle when it's that obvious. Great call there by the official. Now here's Harden. He's got 31. Here's McGrady. Again, the Rockets score. Well-rounded effort, and, and they show no signs of letting up. Yeah, not just an impressive showing on offense, but on defense as well, executing their game plan perfectly. Let's check in with our reporter, David Aldridge. 
Thanks very much, Kevin. Now, in recent years, the league has flattened the lottery odds and created the play-in tournament to keep more teams motivated. Commissioner Adam Silver knows some teams are in a development phase, but doesn't want to see maneuvering for better draft picks. He says teams are smarter, they're creative, and they respond. We move, they move. Kevin? Just like that. DA, thank you. Garen passes to Anthony. Over Malone. Anthony's shot is off. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. I'm sure they'll think twice about shooting against him next time. Now, here is Harden. 16-point lead, the largest margin in the game. Another miss by Houston. And so it's Frazier who will bring it up for New York. Reed dishes to Anthony. Pass to Ewing. Here's Garen trying to end the drought. Good, and it's Ewing with the assist that time. Ewing's got his third assist on the night. Harden against Frazier. Harden can't hit. And here are the Knicks. Trailing by 13. Frazier kicks to Reed. Down low. Here's Ewing over Elijah Wan. Oh, and what a play by Ewing. Ewing's got 12 points in the game. And boy, did he ever sell the pump fake. Worked to absolute perfection. Passes it to Malone. Houston moving it around. Harden the pass to Malone. McGrady outside. Nailed from three-point land. Ten points for him. The most underrated part of Harden's game, his playmaking. James is amazing at setting up other players. Ewing a screen on Harden. Frazier kicks to Reed. Double team on Ewing. Back to Reed. Pass to Guerin. Reed with it. Here's Ewing, guarded by Harden. And here's Anthony from the arc. And again, New York with the triple. Well, Anthony is just this competitive. He wants everyone to know what he can do. McGrady outside. Harden outside. Fires the three. It's rebounded by New York. Reed's got his fifth rebound in this one. To the inside. Ewing had a chance there to cut it to single digits, but it's off target. Rockets leading by 11. Harden outside. He dishes it to Elijah Wan. Kicks it to McGrady. Malone, the pass to Elijah Wan. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. It's going to be on Willis Reed. And guys, let's get your take on the hustle stats for the Rockets. They've been just suffocating on defense the whole game. Look at their shot blocking. The opposition doesn't have any room to breathe. Take a break. Take and we break. also got to highlight how lackluster the opposition has been in terms of boxing out. This team is flat out bullying them on the offensive glass. And that one falls for Elijah Wong. DeBusher, he's checked in for New York. And a switch here also for Houston. Murphy's checked in. That one is no good. Knicks trail by 12. Frazier outside. Here's DeBusher. Anthony, no one around. And a miss there with a chance to cut the lead to single digits. The pass to Harden. Over to Bush. Harden's shot is off. Whatever rhythm he had last quarter, it has left his body. He is having a hard time finding buckets. Ewing can't hit. Rockets leading by 12. Three-pointer. 
And Harden gets it to go in on the assist by Murphy. Murphy's got three assists tonight. One of the league's best scores. Harden knows his team depends on him to help shoulder most of that offensive load. Reed the pass to Anthony. Reed against Elijah Wan. Reed misses. Reed's gone two for seven, struggling a bit. Harden kicks to Drexler. Over to Bushman. Shots good by Drexler. Drexler's got his first basket of the night. Knicks trail by 17. Pass to Reed. On the wing, Ewing. He's covered by Malone. And it's been a while, but he finally gets one to go. Ewing's got six in the quarter. And when he rises up, he knows he's probably going to get a clean look. It's a matter of executing. Yeah, the defender just lacks the reach to be able to contest him properly. The Rockets making a switch here. New York with the ball. 15-point game. Passes it to Houston. Fires from deep. Good, and it's Frazier who picks up the assist. Houston's got six. And this is where Houston is at his best. So good at just catching and shooting. Elijah on left side. Over to Bush. And there's the call on Yao. That is his first foul of the game. Oh, he sees the mismatch, and he just goes to attack, keeping his jumper out of the defense's reach just too little. Is Frazier. He's got six. To Busher passes to Frazier. Takes the three. That one's in there. Rocket lead is cut down now to just 11 on the basket from Houston. And we see Houston take a healthy amount of threes for a reason. This guy very accurate from beyond. Now here is Elijah Wong. Tried to bank it in, but he misses. King, left side. He feeds it to Reed. Over Murphy. No good there, and that would have cut it to single digits. Rockets leading by 11. One thirty left to play in the third. Frazier against Harden. Five on the clock. To the paint. It's deflected. Reed with the steal. Three on three. Here's to Busher. And he gets the bucket. I'll tell you, they're right in this. We'll see if they can maintain momentum. Things are firing on all cylinders for them right now. We'll see if they can keep it going. Now, here is Harden. He's got 34. It's tipped. Frazier with it. And it's Harden picking him up. It'll go. The rocket lead is cut down now to just seven on the basket from Frazier. I tell you, he has some impressive moves in his repertoire. That's as good as it gets, but just one of many. Pass to Yao. Here's Tom Janovich. And some nice passing there by Houston. Here's Elijah Wan over to push. And it's Elijah Wan missing. Well, some trips you get the shot you want, it just doesn't fall. I'd go back to him in that area on the floor. Six second difference between the shot and game clock. Frazier kicks to DeBush. And there's the pass to Houston. Elijah Wan with the puck. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Elijah Wan. Twelve seconds left here in the third quarter. Clock at four. Frazier the pass to Stoudemire. And the shot goes in. Stoudemire's got 12 points in the game. They didn't have much of a problem getting the ball into the post that time. The deep three from Harden. And no good on the last second attempt this time. And we've reached the end of the third. Houston on top. Up by five. And after a quick break, we're going to come right back with the start of the fourth quarter.
Well, what a terrific game it's been so far with this fourth quarter sure to bring more pressure-packed basketball. Knicks trail by five. Stoudemire out there with King. Then there's Frazier. Then it's Ewing, and it's Guerin in at the shooting guard position. That's the five for New York right now. Now here's Paul. After the miss from Walt Frazier. Paul passes to McGrady. Here's Tom Janovich. McGrady outside. Can't get it to go. He's made four and just missed his fourth. Frazier against Paul. Frazier left side. Stoudemire with a screen on Paul. Here's Frazier. Gets in and he's a very efficient five for six on the game. And that's right in his wheelhouse. Looking to make an impact when it counts. And his team needs every bit of his production if they want to pull this one out. It is neck and neck here in the final period. Now here is McGrady. Pass to Tom Janovich. Shots over King. And it's Tom Janovich missing. Knicks trail by three. On the wing, Ewing. Passes it to King. Here's Guerin. And it's Houston on the break. And here they go. Nice pass. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. Well, so often we see this transition buckets off turnovers. And there's no defense for that. Live ball turnovers, they are the worst. Here's Guerin. Back to Stoudemire. The bucket is good. He'll have a chance for one more. It goes on Moses Malone. To Busher, he's checked in for King. And a switch here also for Houston. Murphy's checked in. First team foul. At the line for the Knicks, Amari Stoudemire. At the line, one shot. minutes into the fourth quarter now. Ball against Frazier. Here's Yao. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Puts on Patrick Ewing. This is where the size of Ming is just too much. I have to foul him when he's that close. Two shots. The first free throw is good. And, and, you know, he's such a huge figure from a cultural standpoint. Yao is also someone teammates love playing with because of that easygoing personality. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. Some big guys struggle at the line. Not him. He's put in the work to defy that assumption. They set the pick. Here's Frazier. Out the basket. Frazier's got four this quarter. And you want him taking big shots for you in big moments. That one was as easy as it gets. Yeah, it's clear why they go to him in these moments. They know he's going to deliver for him. Now here's Paul. Pass to Yao. Kicks it out to Paul. Front pass the arc. Hits it from three-point range. The defense cannot give Paul any airspace, even as the pass is coming his way. Garen passes to Ewing. Stoudemire outside. 
Shot clock at six. Gary off the mark there with a the three-point shot. And he didn't punish them for the weak coverage there, but they can't count on him to continue missing. Yao with a screen on DeBusher. McGrady kicks to Yao. The pass to Murphy. A three ball. Stoudemire grabs the board. And the defense dodged one right there. Not the guy you want to leave open. Here's Frazier. Yao with the block. The busher against McGrady. Out to the right wing. Call with the three. And Stoudemire pulls it down. Knicks trail by five. Pass to Frazier. Ewing left side. The kick out to Frazier. Pass to Guerin. Stoudemire with a screen on Murphy. Here's Garrett. Yao with the block. Paul against Frazier. On the wing, Malone. Back to Paul. From downtown. The Knicks pull it in. Ewing's got 15 rebounds here tonight. Frazier kicks to DeBusher. Stoudemire outside. New York moving it around. Right wing. Down to five on the shot clock. Stoudemire with a screen on Murphy. New York, no good that time either. Rockets leading by five. McGrady outside. Gal the pass to McGrady. Takes it from 10. Connects. The jumper drops. He just exudes a love of the game, guys. You can see it in everything he does. This guy lives and breathes the game. Here's Garen. Ewing inside. Defended by Yao. Stoudemire kicks to DeBush. Here's Frazier over Paul. Can they get it? And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. And one of the very best in our league at getting to the line. Walt, Walt Frazier just has that great change of pace and aggressive nature. Always playing, though, under control. And that one misses. So both teams making some changes here. And he's good on the second. Here's Francis. Now a timeout called by Houston. Houston. reporter David Aldridge. What's the latest, David? Hey, guys. Well, the Rockets coach had some words for his team during the timeout. He told his players, I love the energy right now. You look like you're having fun out there. Keep playing for each other because our chemistry looks great right now. Back to you guys. Thank you, David. Stolen. Into the lane. Whoa, just Houston. turning on the gas there. Look at Houston move on that drive. 13. At the line for the Knicks. 
Allen Houston. At the line, two shots. And the first one drops. Both shots good from the strike. Rockets leading by four. Here's Francis. Elijah outside. Stolen by DeBusher. And a fast break now for New York. Here's Frazier. Nice shot from the wing. Frazier's got seven points here in this quarter. A quality pass setting up a quality shot. It's just textbook basketball. Pass to Elijah Wan. Excellent D there from DeBusher. And Anthony's got the ball here for the New York Knicks. Trailing by two. type of challenge Anthony presents to the defense. Sometimes they are just forced to the foul. At the line for the Knicks, Carmelo Anthony. At the line, two shots. It and the next one could tie it up. Houston making a switch here. McGrady's checked in. And it's tied up with that one. And so it's Houston with it. Harden dishes to McGrady. Pulls up on the elbow. It's hauled in by Ewing. Ewing's got his 16th rebound on the night. Elijah Wan against Frazier. Ewing. Good. Great play set up by Frazier. Frazier's got his eighth assist here tonight. You've got to give them a lot of credit for just battling back into this game. And it's so much easier said than done. But now it's all about keeping that momentum going for them. And that one's good. But great. And the Rockets lead by one. It's been a tight one so far. Very close game. And matchups. It's really what it's all about. And these two teams are really equal. Now here's Anthony over Drexel. Anthony's shot is off. And he felt like he needed a little bit more space with the fade to get off a shot, but that might have been what threw him off and made a miss. Here's Harden. Ivan the lane. Goes up and lays it nice and easy. Harden's got 36. Making the difficult look easy. That's what James Harden does. Taking contact, making the basket. The pass to Carmelo. Fades back. That one falls. Anthony's got 13 points in the second half. Nice play call there. Down the stretch, getting him the open look. And late in games, throw out those analytics. Give me the mid-range. The shot, it just works. Now, here is Elijah Wong. A wide open look for Drexler. And another three for Houston. So many of the plays they're running designed to create opportunities from deep. With the way they're shooting, there's no need to look for any other shot. Just keep running it rain. And that one is good. Frazier's got nine points now in the quarter. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Yeah, as soon as these guys feel contact, they are just disappearing like they're not even there. You gotta show some fire and keep defending. 
Now here's Harden. Six on the shot clock. Launches it from deep. The shot, no good. And as long as he keeps missing from deep, the D will keep letting him fire away. He's just off from range right now. Ewing against Yao. Fades. Rebound by Yao Ming. They came close there to tying it up. You love the intensity out there right now. Close game. Both teams leaving it all out there. Now here's Yao. Here's Harden. And good. He nails it. Harden's got 38 points. I-C-E. Ice. He has absolute ice in his veins. This guy, he lives for these moments. Anthony against Drexler. And then Ewing with the jam. And that's leadership right there. Anthony wanting to work the rock over to an open teammate. Now a timeout called by Houston. Houston. Checked in for Houston. Substitution. Number 24. Moses Malone. against Frazier. Elijah Wan outside. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. Free throw is good, and that makes it a three-point lead. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a four-point ball game. See, it's easy to see why his teammates trust him. He's a leader on this team and loves coming up huge in the clutch. Garen passes to Ewing. Reed against Malone. Pocket six. Frazier outside. Over Harden. The putback. Boy, he just hasn't been able to get his shot to fall. Drexler dishes to McGrady. Elijah on with a screen for McGrady. On the wing, Harden. He bombs up the alley -oop pass. Reed with the steal. Here's Garen. Pass to Anthony. A three. Elijah on grabs the miss. McGrady up top. Frazier covering. Here's Harden. That shot misses. Anthony with the defensive effort. Here's Garen. Drexler defending. Garen no good. And that's an intentional foul. Fifth to throw foul. Thirteen. He 
drops the first one and that puts them up by five. So he gets them both and it's a six point ball game. He knows how important it is converting at the line and building up this lead. New York calls timeout. They trail by six. 34 seconds left in the fourth. What's your take, guys? They're trying to get back in this thing. They need a score. Yeah, it has to be fast. They got to take the first good look they get. the pass to Carmelo. Got it! And now they trail by just four. And Carmelo is a gamer. When, when the game is close, this guy wants the ball and more importantly delivers in the clutch. Shooting for Houston, James Harden. At the line, two shots. Shoot two. So the first one drops, and that puts them up by five. And so both free throws are good, and it's a six-point ball game. Game could be on the line right here. It's time now out, or out. never. New York. New York calls timeout. Marty. They're trailing by six. 27 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Anthony left side. Six seconds separating the shot and game clocks. It's good! And now they trail by just four. Scoring at an efficient clip tonight. Mello in that zone. And they stop the clock as soon as they can with the intentional foul. He had to foul and on that occasion to stop the clock. That's the enemy in this situation. At the line, two shots. Shooting two. Drops the first one, and that puts them up by five. So he gets them both, and it's a six-point ball game. And it's Anthony with the ball for New York. He kicks it to Reed. Frazier outside. From outside the arc, Hakeem Olajuwon grabs the rebound. So they foul intentionally. Second place, no foul. Team is in the penalty. At the line for the Rockets, Hakeem Olajuwon. At the line, two shots. Shooting two.
Gets the first, and that makes it a seven-point lead. Second free throw, no good that time. He really wanted that one. Ewing outside. Here's Reed. Off target with that shot. So we see the Rockets get the win here. A narrow win under difficult circumstances, Greg, as the visiting team. It really was, but that didn't seem to bother them. I mean, road team, home team, all I know is they were the better team. Well said. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. This is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for tuning in as we present our New Balance Player of the Game, James Harden.